Good morning, guys. It is 7.30 now. Got home at two o'clock in the morning from Vegas last night. We got delayed about five hours yesterday, three times, so it was a long day. Got home, it was really cold and icy, but now just got picked up from a friend and we're heading to Montreal. It's a weekend boys work trip, so looking forward to it. All right, see you guys in a bit. So we're about two and a half hours away. 300 kilometers, taking another little break, stretch out the legs. It's about a five and a half hour trip to Montreal from Toronto. All right guys, just had to come out and stretch my legs. That's the ride we're taking right now. It's my buddy's Jeep pickup truck. Nice truck. Decided to go with uh, from Starbucks, everything, ham, egg, and cheese, and a ginger ale. Breakfast of champions right here. We're cruising on about 135 kilometers all the way there. Smooth sailing. Got to Quebec. We're still about 45 minutes to Montreal, but we always stop here to get some uh, cheap drinks. Cheap liquor, cheap beer. Let's go see. All right, Ash, look at this. They got Corona's 45 bottles for a 69.99. There it is, downtown Montreal. Am I missing something here though? Only in Montreal does buses and taxis have their own lane on the highway? How many damn buses and taxis do they got? We need some help. All the signs are in French. We don't know where we're going. Lost. We're lost in Montreal. Lost. I'm just joking. Thank God for GPS. We'll this, take it exactly this, where we're going to go. No, you remember, remember this? Yeah, I remember this. Yeah. Guys, this taxi just backed up into the car and he's taking off. 4486 is his number. Just hit the car and take off. It's the best Western Plus that we're staying at. Nice and close to the downtown. That's the Bell Center at the bottom of the street. Then you have St. Catharines Street, their main downtown, right here. So it's definitely a great location. So we're still trying to get some lunch and then we're gonna. Oh, look, we got a sports bar. Perfect. Free drink in there before WWE tonight. Can't wait. All right, guys, just got to the room. Room 335, and the $20 trick did not work. The guy laughed when I asked. But. Um, just a tiny, tiny little thing. Walk in, little desk area, bed. This room originally was 150 for the night, but we booked last minute and it was 300 for the night. So a little expensive for what you get, a little small, but TV, you have your fridge, got the Cokes. You got a full thing near here. And you got the bathroom. Yeah, it's clean. It's not the biggest, but it does the job. This will be my home for the next two nights. The one thing I forgot to show is the view. Not bad, not bad. Buddy Rui's room. Exact same kind of room, but he has a little bit of a better view than I do. He paid for the upgrade. I'm just joking. <laughs> All right, the boys just got here from uh, what Toronto. Up? What up? We're getting ready to go to the hotel, have some free drinks, and then head down to the WWE. Can't wait. All right, this is Isaac and James's room. Say what's up, guys. What, what up? up? What up? They got the two queen. So it's a little bit bigger than ours, that's for sure. 
No bunking together. I was a little no bunking together. Yeah. They were gonna share a bed, spoon. but it didn't really happen. Good. It's okay. Good, good. The bathroom. Better than my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> no, we got a bathtub. We don't even have a bathtub. You have a bathtub? No, we only have a shower. Nice. Yeah. Well, they have bathtub. Yeah, they have a bathtub. Okay. Wasn't this the room we had for two nights, really? <laughs> and there's the back. Great view. Cruising down St. Catherine Street in Montreal. We're heading over to the mall. We're going to the merchandise store. My buddy James wants to buy a WWE belt. So we're gonna go check it out. See you guys in a bit. All right guys, we just came inside the mall. We're looking for the uh, WWE merch store. There's about a 15 minute walk here, but we're here now. We're looking for a WWE belt. Which one are you going to get? World title for sure. World title, eh? Yeah, that's the thing right there. That's the Ric Flair one, right? Eh? Oh, yeah. Nature Boy. Oh, no. 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 Oh, you go. Just keep it over to count. Is it yeah. likely you're going to go for that one? Because I'll go get it for you. Thousand percent, yeah. Oh, a thousand percent. That's pretty good. That's the one he's going with. How much is that one? Four seventy-five. Four seventy-five. He's thinking. He's looking at the original as well, guys. That looks nice. I'll give you this one. This one too. That's the old school they have? All right, the boys leaving the WWE merch store. I got a Roman Reigns t-shirt. I'll show you guys later. Rui got something for the kids. James got two belts. WWE belts that we'll I showed you guys earlier. Like Isaac got a hat and a shirt. And what did Josh get? Get a shirt. And another shirt. All right, guys, we're finally going to get something to eat. We're going to check this place out. Fish and chips. Let me see it. Yeah. Looks good. I got the chicken Slovakia dinner. Looks pretty good. Josh, what'd you get, buddy? Mozzarella sticks and fries. Mozzarella sticks. Nice. Really? Mozzarella sticks and the chicken wings. Everything looks good, guys. I'm gonna dig it right now. All right, guys, we're just chilling in the room right now. We just got back. We're hanging out with uh, Rui, James, Isaac, ran into some other friends, Keegan and Jasmine. We're just chilling in the room, having some pre drinks before we go to WWE Elimination Chamber. <laughs> See you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we're getting ready to head to WWE Elimination Chamber. And guess what? I got the belt. That's it. You know, is it upside down? It's upside down, brother. I'm up to. It is it? Yeah, it is upside down. It's okay. Right. We can make bloopers too. No problem. The champ is here, guys. The champ, the champ is, is here. here. Let's go. Let's go. Vegas Legacy. We out. We're just walking down to the Bell Center. It's literally not even a five minute walk from the hotel. I know. I know. It's getting rowdy out here. There's lots of people. Okay, good time. James, the champ is here. Walk out. I'm sorry. Yeah, the champ is here, boy. Let's go. Anytime, any place. <laughs> Let's go. All right, guys. We just made it to the Bell Center. We're out front. We're getting ready to head in to watch WWE Elimination Chamber. Everyone's excited. The crowd's going wild. That's Dude. it. For sure. Here we go. Let's go. Alright guys, we're in our seats now. Our friends are sitting over here. And we're sitting just a couple sections beside them. 
but I'm going to try to ask whoever sits down beside them if they'll switch seats if I buy them a round of beers. So I'll let you know how that turns out. But these are our seats for now. It's not bad view. There's not a bad seat in this place. Good afternoon guys, it's day two, didn't get to finish off the vlog last night, we all got pretty drunk and I just went to bed, so it's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon now, just getting ready to start the day, we're going to go grab some lunch, me and Ruri, uh, probably Dunn's it's called, um, smoked meat sandwiches, but we'll just go see, we want to go to Schwartz as well, but we went there yesterday and the lineup was down the street been there since 1928 so hopefully we'll hit that as well either tonight or tomorrow all right see you guys in a bit <laughs> 